North Dakota with the tournament taking place Thursday through Saturday in the Fargo Dome. Throughout the week, we'll be highlighting the teams from the West that have punched a ticket to the big dance, including a few first timers. In Class B, Central McLean is on its way to the state tournament for the first time ever as a co-op. The Turtle, make, Turtle Lake Mercer portion of the co-op went to state in 2004, but for this group, it will be an entirely new experience that they earned by sweeping each of their opponents in the Region 5 tournament. Um, I'm just so proud of these kids, you know, we've worked hard for a long time, my group of seniors, um, the last two years it we kind of in semis, it's kind of been gut punched, and this year we came in with a mentality of we're just going to take it day by day, and um, that's exactly what they did, but I, I'm just so proud, I'm so excited for these girls, they deserve it so much. Uh, it feels great, we knew that we could do it this year, and so we worked hard all season, and we knew it was going to be tough coming in here, but it's just so good to finally do it. Well, here's how the Class B bracket shakes out. The Cougars will play game two of the day against the Region 3 champs. Medina, Pingree, Buchanan, Dickinson, Trinity will follow them against the top-seeded Cardinals. In Class A, Legacy is making its fifth straight state tournament appearance. The Sabres er entered the WDA tournament as the five seed and came out as the three seed out of the West. It's an opportunity that isn't taken lightly for a group that returned only one starter from last season to this year. There's definitely been so much improvement on this team, like every single person. You know, the team that we were at the beginning of the season is completely different from who we are now. I feel like we all knew we had it in us, and we just, we all work so well together, and we just need to just, I don't really know, just keep loving each other and keep working hard, and we got it. Well, here's the bracket for Class A. Legacy will play in the final game on day one against West Fargo Horace. Century is the one seed and will play Davies while Bismarck faces off against Shanley. The North Dakota High School Coaches Association announced the nine-man All-State team today. The state champs from New Rockford land five players on the first team. Linton's Gentry Richter and Cashton Moser make the list as well. Here's the second team for All-State. Grant County Flasher and Central McLean both have two honorees. Teddy Kirschman and Tristan Schaffner are the only players from their team named to the list. 